Hi everyone, welcome to Hedgehog Hollow. So today I'm showing you a really great hack to save money and we all love those. So Tilly loves all of these character prints and all those kinds of things, but those tops are expensive. So I have found a way to do them for just a few dollars each. I went through Joanne's clearance. There is tons of licensed character fabric in there. I mean, look at this piece here. Now I bought a yard just because I didn't know how much I was gonna need. And then I just measured it around Tilly with a little bit of stretch in it. And I made myself a snip so that I can show you the next steps. So we're gonna lay this out on our rotary board or you can cut with scissors. Um, I just happen to have this because I do some quilting. And then I'm gonna make a straight cut down here. So somewhere along. It's a little bit harder to do just because of all the pleats in it, but you can just kind of straighten it out and then make yourself a cut. I'm gonna use my rotary cutter here and I like to keep it in this case. And I'll link everything we use as always up. And this is a super long ruler. I use this for Christmas tree skirts and all sorts of great quilting projects. Let's just make sure it's done there. And so the little off cut, if you have an off cut like this, it's perfect for either a younger sibling or you could do uh, an American Girl version. So to do that, all you do is you would cut down here, re-hem, and then again, cut and re-hem. So really simple, just a zigzag stitch on your machine or if you have a serger overlocker, that works too. Now, all I'm gonna do is turn this around like this, put my two ends together, and I'm gonna do a quick zip stitch down here. So make sure you do a little backwards and forwards at the beginning, because bear in mind that top is gonna get the most stress. So again, just keep zipping your way down. Really, really simple to do. And I just do a little bit of time. You could pin or clip if you wanted to as well. trim off our threads and of course you can just trim up your threads now I would press this seam open which I'll do afterwards but just pop your iron down this seam and press it open and then if you wanted to you could attach like some little um, spaghetti straps like just some pieces of lace or elastic if you wanted to but Tilly is very much a little sundress girl and she tends to wear cardigans over the top as well but I made it snug so that it will stay up on here but here you go here is a little sundress and you can see on your screen now how Tilly looks in that lovely little dress isn't she super cute even though it's a cold time of year here but I wanted to show you because these are great gifts to make you can make them the whole year through so many different things you can do with them and anything with this ruched top is that easy you can make it you can see me I've been videoing for like four minutes and I've made a whole dress for Tilly that's how simple it is so i hope you enjoyed today's tutorial don't forget to hit subscribe ring the bell thumbs up and of course join us for the rest of our creativation coverage coming up in just a couple of weeks and we've got some other fun ideas on the way for you as well so i'll see you again tomorrow with another tip trick tutorial or maybe something a little bit different but in the meantime happy crafting and have a great day see you soon bye